I see so many of my dear friends on here struggling from the middle of the month on saying they don't have any food or they don't have any money for food. It's hard right now and it's hard for everybody. And if you're on a fixed income and you're supplementing with food stamps, it's even harder. If you can get to a food bank, please do. There's no shame in it. And if you can't, let me help you a little bit. I grew up dirt poor. So I learned from the age of 10 how to stretch a dollar. In fifth grade, my mother used to send me to the store because I could stretch our budget further than she could. Start off beans and rice. That's your staple. Dried beans. Dried rice. Learn to cook them. Get a variety of different beans because each bean is going to give you a different nutritional value. So pinto beans, white beans, uh, green peas, black eyed peas, navy beans, black beans, whatever you like get a variety. Kidney beans, garbanzo beans. I could go on. That's your protein. You don't need meat, but you can add meat to it if you want and if you can afford it. If you can't, you'd be a whole lot healthier if you just leave the meat go. Add your rice to it. You can add anything else you want and change it up because you don't want to eat the same thing all the time. You can add onions, uh, mushrooms, bell peppers, sweet peppers, um, corn, tomatoes, squash, potatoes, cheese, anything. The sky's the limit. Any vegetable that you like and you can afford you can put that in there. It can be canned, it can be fresh. I recommend frozen because your frozen vegetables are picked at the peak of ripeness and then frozen. Whereas your fresh stuff is picked when it, before it's ripe and shipped to market and it ripens up as it's shipped. So you have more nutritional value and better flavor from frozen. And you don't have to worry about it going soggy in the bottom of your fridge before you used it and then you threw it away and you wasted your money. Can't waste anything. Hope this helps.